It's easy to create a professional looking website yourself these days with sites like Weebly. Weebly is good at many things. One thing it hasn't been good at traditionally is streaming video. And when you get a video on Weebly, quite often it stops and it waits and it buffers and then it decides to play again. And that's no good if you're a professional like myself. I'm a professional voice artist. And on my website, I want videos, TV commercials and documentary clips to play without any of this buffering and jerking and things. I want to look professional. And that's not unfortunately possible. Online, you've probably seen many complaints to Weebly over the years over this thing. And the usual thing they say is that upload a smaller video or whatever, but actually that doesn't make any difference. I've tried all this myself. It doesn't matter what size of video and also what data rate either, because they encode it when you upload it to the Weebly site. So here's a way of getting completely smooth video playback from your Weebly site. Now you can use YouTube, but a far more professional way is to use Vimeo. I don't work for Vimeo, I just happen to have an account. I just know it works really smoothly. You've got loads of options there and it's better than YouTube. So in Vimeo, you go on settings and then you can set your thumbnail. You can't do that on Weebly, even though people have been asking for years, but you can on Vimeo. So once you've selected your thumbnail, you go back to settings again, then on to embed. On the right hand side, have a look at all these different options here. Well, you don't want any of the uh, forget the like, you don't want the watch later, show Vimeo logo, no. So deselect all of those. All you need are play bar, volume and full screen, surely. It's up to you, but they're the ones I want anyway. At the bottom, decide what happens when the video has stopped playing. I prefer my commercials to loop so the clients can watch it again without having to click on it again. After you've done that, click save. Now, top left hand corner, click the actual title of the video. That will get you back to the playback page here. On the video, you'll see uh, the share button, this little paper aeroplane. Click on that. Now, show options. It's very important to show options. Little thing here, then size. You don't want fixed. You do not want fixed. You want responsive. So the size of the video frame adjusts to whatever the person is watching your website on. Tablet, phone, laptop, whatever. Untick stuff you don't need here. Just highlight the text in the embed box. Don't bother reading it. Just control C, copy it over, then go to Weebly. So on your Weebly edit page, you need to look for embed code on the left hand side. If you can't see it, you need to click show all elements. Once you've got that, drag it over to where you want your video to be and then simply paste the code control V into your box. Click outside, your video will appear and it'll smoothly play. Not from Weebly, of course, it'll be playing from the Vimeo site and Vimeo's servers are specially optimized for smooth video playback. OK, everybody's happy. I hope you found that useful. Check out my voiceover website. It's peterbakervo.com or peterbakervoiceover.com.